What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. So today is another first impressions. I feel like a lot of my videos lately have been first impressions. However, um, if you haven't seen my latest video, it is a first impressions of this wig, if you couldn't tell, because it's obviously not my natural hair. But anyway, we're gonna do a beautylish first impressions. This is my very first time ever uh, shopping on Beautylish, so I'm excited. Um, but before we get into that, please be sure to subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up, share with your friends and family. You can follow me on other social medias as well. Just, just saying. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. So, <laughs> we got this bad boy. Uh, I had to figure out how to open this. Um, but I am excited for this because this was launched on 420, okay? Okay, and if you are a fellow 420 celebrator, I wish I was that person, obviously not, you know that they released a 420 themed brush set. Mm -hmm. So let's go ahead and get into this. So you get like their little, uh, I guess it's, well, obviously it's your receipt and then they give you numbers on the back that you can call in case you have a problem with your order. Oh, there's two things. God, there's boxes all over my floor. This is the packaging. Oh my gosh. Little pot leaves. Now, I don't have a problem with pot, okay? I'll tell you right now. So. I needed this, okay? I didn't want, I didn't, I, I needed it, okay? Did I need it? Yes. Did I want it? Yes. Did I get it? Hell yeah. So, mm, here we have, I don't want to throw that packaging away. It's adorable. More packaging. And then here we get makeup brush, makeup brush, makeup. Ugh, I can't speak. You get a little brush bag and from what I can tell, it's hella cute. Oh my gosh, you guys, I have such a mess on the floor. I'm gonna clean that up after this. You get, this is so cute. It's a little uh, green bag with some uh, styrofoam in it. I think it's styrofoam, I don't know what that is. This is adorable. So it kind of reminds me of like Jeffree Star's makeup bags. So you get this bad boy. My floor is a mess. I do apologize. Here is, I don't know what this is. I don't know what this. Uh, what is it? What is it? The Sibium Collection. This is this new generation of oil control skincare balances your skin serum. Production to prevent clogged pores. Skin is left smooth and clear with a healthy matte finish. Not dry, tight, or uncomfortable. It's a uh, Bioderma Sebrum. Formulated for oily and acne pro uh, acne pro skin. Ooh. I guess they just kind of put that in there as a little gift since you ordered a a set. And last but not least, we have our rushes in this very non-discreet bag. Is it even a bag? I sorry. I saw. I'm sorry if I feel like I'm going through this very quickly. I'm just excited. Plus I have a mess on the floor I don't wanna clean up. So obviously it's taped. It is a bag. Oh my gosh, it's a brown bag. That's not weird at all. Actually, I'm hella excited. And they're adorable. Oh my gosh, they're little brushes. So let's just open these one at a time. Okay, so I'm trying to put things in the garbage. You get a powder brush, I'm assuming it's a powder brush with this very nice protectant on it. I'm gonna break the brush. Sorry, you guys. I'm just gonna tear it because I don't care. <gasps> okay, so here is the handle. It has little cannabis leaves on the brush itself. Oh, that is very soft, okay. It's like a nice green, kind of like your best friend on 420. Um, next thing we get, I think it's a powder brush. Here I would say is a contour brush maybe, or 
It was kind of dense. It might be a concealer. Might be contour concealer. I don't know. They don't say on there anywhere. It's got little pot leaves on there. It has little pot leaves on it. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm excited. I saw these and I was like, do I need those? Hell yeah. Treat myself. That's the first thing I did when I woke up that day. Actually, they released a few days before 420. So, of course, I woke up and I was like, I need that. Here we have a very tight brush that I don't know how to get it. Oh, okay, it's open at the top. This looks like it's a blending brush. These brushes are hella cute. I might never actually use these. Would that cheat as a forced impression if I don't use them? But here we have more, and of course, it's very soft. Perfect for blending. I just want something I can put those in so I can uh, show them off, because y'all look at my pot leaf brushes. Yeah? And no, YouTube, I can't get in trouble because it's not actual pot. I'm not gonna pull a Jeffree Star and smoke some weed on the internet because he got in trouble for that, and I don't wanna get in trouble. This looks like it's a packing brush. It's still green, more leaves. These actually can stand up on their own too. And I just knocked them almost all over. So last brush. So I mean, you get a pretty decent amount of brushes for the price that you pay. I paid $42 and I think I got free shipping because it was over 35. I'm not gonna wanna clean that up later. And then here you have a crease brush. These are hella adorable. Okay, so I figured I'd do a first impressions by using these because someone was like, it's not a first impressions if you don't use it. Well, listen here, Susie Q. It doesn't have to be a first impressions to use the product. The first impressions could be anything from seeing the product for the very first time or using the product. It doesn't matter. So we're gonna use this bad boy. This is the Blood Sugar Palette by Jeffree Star and I thought it was appropriate to use cannabis um, brushes. I guess brushes with cannabis leaves on them because Hello, Jeffree Star, weed. Hello, that's like the first thing I think of when I think of Jeffree Star is weed. I don't wanna use these cause they're hella cute and clean and I don't wanna mess them up. But we're gonna take this blendy brush. I do have eyeliner on, but that's okay. I'm a mess today, so. What should I take, you guys? Hmm, this palette is hella pigmented by the way. I used it the other day and I was like, well. So I think we should take ouch okay 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 let's just check this i mean it's okay okay we're gonna pack that on not pack it duh. we're gonna blend that on i'm gonna have to wipe my makeup off anyway after this so it doesn't matter but you guys that's hella pigmented jeffrey i want to know what you were smoking when you made this palette i want some and if, if weed bothers you, feel free to leave my channel because no, I don't smoke weed on camera. And no, I really actually don't smoke weed quite a bit because weed is illegal in my state and I could go to jail for it. So we don't wanna go to jail today. Okay, so we took that, I'm gonna wipe off my brush and now we're gonna take Extraction, which is this hella cute shade down here. It's like a plum shade, and we're gonna pack, no. We're gonna put that kinda, we're gonna kinda mix it in. And if you have ever wanted to get this palette, get it, because it's amazing. I'm just saying. Like, if you want a good palette that won't you know play you because i know some some brands will price their palettes like hella expensive like 65 dollars for a small palette that isn't really that good <coughs> natasha denona mm. but this is like a really good palette and no it's not like i was gonna say crusty it's not like patchy i'm just building it up because it's easily buildable and now we're gonna take hmm we're gonna take root canal. I'm really just playing you guys because I want to see how these brushes work. I'm not using the face brushes because I'm trying to keep my face clean. So now we're gonna take root canal and we're just gonna kind of work our way down. And that was a that was a that was a shade I used 
a while back and it was extremely pigmented because I've only used this palette once. I keep meaning to use it for school and I'm just <laughs> lazy. Okay, so now, 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 I'm probably, okay. I'm gonna take this brush, which I think is a packing brush. And we're gonna take Donor, which is this hella cute coppery shade. I don't even think it's copper. And we're just gonna do, 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 do. I know it's going over my eyeliner. I'll put new eyeliner on. And I mean, we're just keeping it subtle. Something that you can wear out. Yo, Jeffrey, I'm telling you, share whatever you're smoking because it's, I really love it. And I can't do makeup on camera. Like, I don't know why. And I almost dropped my palette. So, yeah. And now we're gonna use some eyeliner. I have multivitamins over here. And we're gonna take the NYX Epic Ink Liner. I haven't actually used this yet. Um, I got it for Easter. Because obviously the Easter Bunny exists because he brought me makeup. So, I'm just gonna go over what we already had for eyeliner. Doo -doo. What's your favorite song? Like, are you gonna be the cool kid that listens to cool music? I kid you not, guys, I used to listen to show tunes. Yeah. I used to listen to show tunes. Okay, you guys, here is the look. Um, I'm obviously messing with my lighting right now, but that's really nice. Hey. Um, so yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching. I actually really enjoyed this. Um, thank you Beautylish for creating such epic products. This is the only thing I've ever bought from Beautylish, but I knew I just had to have it. Also, anybody who has the Melt palette, the Smoke Sessions palette, can you please tell me how that is? Cause I'm in the market for some green stuff. Not not that green stuff, um, green eyeshadows. And I wanted to know what you all thought of the smoke, uh, the smoke Sessions palette. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Please be sure to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up 50 times because it was just that good. Um, share with your friends and family. But if your family doesn't like pot or they think that it's Satan's leaves or whatever the devil's lettuce um tell them that i said hi because i love to be a pest people so without further ado i'm gonna take my nappy looking face and i'm gonna go wash it in the sink because i need to and i'm gonna try some of this from bioderma so i will oh and uh before i forget I'm dropping everything. I'm going to put my little brushes in the bag that they are supposed to go in. Because if you get a bag with your makeup brushes, those brushes have to go in that bag. Like, there's no denying it. They have to. Like, look at that. They fit right in there. And that's going to sit right on my desk. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you around in another video.